I'd like to take this opportunity to thank all of our donors for the support they've given us this year. We know over the last two years we've been in the midst of an infectious pandemic, but this is nested within a much bigger pandemic of cardiometabolic disease, and your support is helping us to address this. Thank you. Heart diseases and diabetes are substantial threats to our life and well-being. Here at the Baker, we use all our determination and skills to understand these diseases and to prevent and treat them. Your support helps us to do this difficult and often challenging work, and it supports our enthusiastic scientists who put all their efforts and enthusiasm into ultimately improving the lives of all of us. Uh, I'd like to thank all of the Baker donors for their tremendous generosity during 2021. Because of your support, we've been able to take our research activities over the past 10 years and actually start to make concrete steps as to how we translate that into new clinical tests so that we can better understand cardiometabolic risk and how we can better translate that information uh, into information that's understandable by both the patients and their doctors. Well, first of all, I'd like to say thank you very much to our very generous donors because without your help, we would not have been able to progress our research this year. This year, we've been able to build on the knowledge that we've gained and we've been able to extend this to find new treatments for cardiovascular disease in diabetic patients. So thank you so much for your support. We could not have done this without you. On behalf of the students at the Baker Heart and Diabetes Institute, we would like to express our uh, thank you um, for the generosity you have made. Um, without your support, we would not have been able to continue with our research um, at this institute. Thank you. Thank you for your help.